with kitty ink and yeah i mean i guess it's time for an update i literally just got to my base um in missouri and i wanted to give you guys a quick empty room tour before i go ahead and start moving in officially so this is the entrance i have a mirror right here kind of wonky looking and then i have my medicine cabinet and my sink here the closet is a lot bigger than i was expecting and my sponsor is so amazing she said that she tried to get me a newly renovated room so everything is super clean in here but you know i still gotta clean it so this is my room and then this is the entranceway but when you walk back here you have the fridge the desk the bed is a full-size bed with the nightstand here we've got some storage underneath here I have a little desk here and my sponsor and some of the girls at the office put together this welcome basket for me which was just so cute literally love them for that it comes with a little trash can here recliner and this is my view i'm literally on the first floor so i don't have to carry any of my things up the stairs as you guys can see i'm out of breath my face is super red it's so hot outside i literally just got done moving everything from my car into my room i had to change my shirt because it was too hot for all that so i'm gonna show you guys my mess i literally brought everything inside of my room and yeah i'm gonna show you guys what that looks like okay so this is my mess i have so many things and this is exactly what i told my boyfriend that i wouldn't do and myself was bring everything in and be overwhelmed by the amount of things that I have <laughs> but I mean it's hot outside and I didn't want to be walking back and forth so I figured I'll just bring it all in in one shot and then we'll start unpacking from there so yeah this is quite literally my mess um I don't know where I'm gonna start I usually start with the bed just because I feel like once my bed is made, it kind of makes my room come together a little bit. So that's where I would usually start. But yeah, it's crazy. It's a lot of things. I know it's a lot of things. You don't got to tell me it's a lot of things. But it all fit in my car. And so it's all going to fit in this room one way or another. But I will show you guys the finished product when everything is put away. Okay, you guys. So quick update. I ended up going to the commissary in the BX before I even finished or started unpacking because I tried to go to the post office to open the mailbox but I can't do that until Monday and then the commissary and the BX were right there so I just figured I'd kill you know two birds with one stone and just hit those shops while I was out there. So when I show you my mess is not gonna look like i made much progress but i promise you guys like things are being put away and unpacked and i feel like i'm almost you know well let me not let me not say i'm almost i'm getting there i'm getting there so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my progress so far so this is a bunch of stuff that i bought like went to the commissary i already put the milk and the creamer in the fridge but yeah so this is my mess from when I went shopping. I already have some things put away in here. I'm debating on whether I'm going to take these extra toilet papers out and put them in the closet and then just put my cleaning supplies there, but we'll see what happens. Got my shower caddy there with most of the supplies that I'm going to use whenever I shower. Here I have my face cleaning supplies my soap those are band-aids um anyway i'm gonna put my toothpaste and my toothbrush in this holder so yeah 
um definitely still have a mess going on i got my shoe rack from the bx so i just went ahead and put my shoes on there and these oakley's do not want to stay put for nothing okay anyway my boyfriend got me oakley's for one of my graduation gifts so that was nice of him but yeah, I'm starting to get some things up in here. I bought more hangers because I just felt like I didn't have enough. I have yet to unpack any clothes, but I am slowly making progress. I got my TV up now. I rearranged the furniture, so I put the fridge back here. I don't know if I'm going to keep it there, but that's where it's at for now. And then I brought the recliner over here and I put the bed in the middle and set up so that I can watch TV from the bed so I moved my desk over in front of the window because I wanted to use the window as a book ledge and eventually I think I'm gonna buy some command hooks so that I can get the curtains out of the way like this because they don't open past this point like they just they don't go past that <laughs> so yeah but I'm using the window ledge as my bookshelf because there was nothing to put my books on i've already unpacked all of my stuff into the drawers so yeah but you know i'll show you guys more later i have this corner open i'm thinking debating on whether i'm gonna put the recliner back over here just so that if i have any friends over they can watch tv in the recliner since it's over here because I was thinking about putting it in this corner but then if I have any friends over like they won't be able to watch TV from the recliner so anywho this is the progress that I'm making I know it doesn't look like I've done anything but I swear to you guys that I have please excuse the way that I'm looking right now I know that I'm a mess <laughs> and yeah so I'm gonna try to go ahead and finish up hello you guys so it is the next day and i'm planning on finishing all of my unpacking today but i want to show you guys my progress so far so we're gonna go ahead and do that real quick so i just came back from walmart i got this little lamp because there is literally only one light over here and once that goes off i'll show you guys it is just like completely dark so i decided to get a little table lamp so that you know at night i can turn off my big light and just leave this on until i'm ready to go to bed and then i picked up a few other things from marshall's and walmart i got a lot of ramen noodles because it's literally my favorite snack i don't know why i don't ask questions but yeah so i'll end up giving you guys a full tour when it's done but i felt like once i put my bed together like, don't mind this, this is my pajamas. I'm getting ready to organize my drawers now. But once I put my bed together, like, I started seeing it come together. So I put the recliner back over there in that corner, like I had spoke about in the last clip, um, nightstand. I want to eventually get, I haven't been able to find one yet. I might order one off of Amazon once I get my mailbox situation figured out. But I think I'm going to put the fridge back over here so that I can hide that outlet. I'm going to get another extension cord. Um, that way I want to put like a little table here next to the fridge so that whenever I'm like prepping food or making my coffee and stuff i can put it here on a table here and use the outlet there with the extension cord that i'm going to connect to it that way it's like you know i don't have to bring my stuff all the way over here to this desk in order to like my coffee i made coffee this morning and then i forgot i didn't get sugar yesterday so yeah so I had to use this outlet, but the outlet for my Keurig is not very long. So I think I kind of just want to make a section over here with a tabletop. That way, whenever I'm prepping food for lunch or for a snack or whatever, making my coffee, I can just do it here right next to the fridge. And then my desk. So I still have a bunch of random knickknacks laying around, but I'm planning on getting all of these things put away today. And then I will show you all the final product. 
Hello you guys. So I am finally done unpacking my room and decorating it. It's really not much well, I don't know if I would say that there's a lot of decoration going on, but it's unpacked and it's all done. So without further ado, I'll go ahead and give you guys the room tour. So this is the door where you first come in. And right here on this wall, I hung up some of these metal command strips. That way I can leave my hat up here and my keys. Um, that's the key to my room and then my car keys and stuff. So um, I don't have anything for this hook yet, but I mean, it'll be there if I need to hang up anything else. And then here we have the closet, which we'll go through in a moment. So this is what my counter is looking like. Actually, this was a soap dispenser that matched with my toothbrush holder, but it's broken and it doesn't work. So I had to go out and buy a new one. This one's from Simple Human and it doesn't match like this, but it does match my sink pretty well. So that's cool. But unfortunately, I have to throw this away. Moving on, I have my face washing section here and I left that here so that I don't forget to wash my face because I tend to do that just being honest. My toothbrush and toothpaste, my hand soap, and then I have this little rubber ducky that my boyfriend won for me at the Dave & Buster's rubber ducky vending machine or the claw machine I meant. I have my paper towel and then I have my hand towel and my washcloth here. On this side of the cabinet, we have my lotion, uh, deodorant, sp body spray, any and other random stuff, Q-tips. Over here, we have some Dayquil, Nyquil for when I get a cold, some alcohol, some cotton swabs so that I can refill this cotton swab holder or some cotton rounds, floss. Um, and then we have the start of some of my medication. Not really medication, like I, it's not uh, prescribed to me, but anyway. And here I have my Listerine um, and then all of my supplements or vitamins, whatever you want to call it. Okay. In this drawer, I just have my random dishwashing stuff. Here we have all of my hair supply. And this drawer is a little wonky, so I really have to like push it hard sometimes. And then in this one, I just have some random things. So I wanted to try that um, method body wash, which I packed for BMT and I didn't really get to use it that much. So I still have it because I did like the way it smelled and I kept it some off and some sunscreen and if you hear that i'm out of breath it's because i just got done cleaning the inside of my car okay here i have um so i ended up taking out the paper towel and the toilet paper and i just put in the cleaning supplies my shower caddy and then all of my laundry stuff is in the back there this is the door to the bathroom that i share with my sweet mate so i ended up getting this command hook and I just have my towel and my robe on there and then moving on over here to the closet okay so this is what my closet is looking like over here on this door I got these are also um command hooks and I got those so that I can hook my mop and my broom on there um and then I have all of my uniforms on this side and some pants because this side was getting pretty full with all my jackets and my dresses and rompers are on this side. I just have some extra storage up here, nothing really too special. And then if I go ahead. Okay, so on this top shelf, I have all of my cooking stuff. So my mini waffle maker, egg maker or egg cooker blender, toaster, and then I just have some extra cups here. On this shelf, don't judge me for my hoard of ramen noodles. It's literally one of my favorite snacks. So I have a bunch of ramen and some protein back there. I have my lunch bag, which I'm gonna use tomorrow for my first day of work. Some Ziploc bags, and then this shelf is empty. I have my hamper underneath it, which fits perfectly. And then come across is my 
shoe rack i have a little yoga mat back there i don't actually do yoga i just want to use it for when i start working out in my room on this shelf i kind of have my purses i kind of just threw this purse there because it's probably going to be out most of the time because it's the purse that i use the most so don't mind it like not fitting in there i'm gonna have my iron and my hair tools and some other random stuff going on here I moved all of the toilet paper and paper towels to this shelf with my extra towel, hand towel, washcloth, stuff like that. This kind of contains my um, extra products and my feminine products. So that is the closet. I'm telling y'all, command hooks really came in clutch for my room. So moving on is this little walkway and here I have my um, whiteboard and then there's literally nothing here in this corner except for my diploma, um, what is this called? Like my diploma frame, which my boyfriend got me for one of my graduation gifts. So I can put the two certificates that I got um, when I graduated tech school in here. Um, I literally have these Glade plugins and they make my entire room smell delicious i just like the cleanest smell uh what <laughs> you guys it's been a long couple days so i can't talk but um i have one over there too this is the linen that they provided me but i'm gonna turn it back in because i don't need theirs so coming over here as you can see i rearranged the furniture so this the, this wall unit kind of sit on this side and i just have my tv up here with my water bottle and this was my coffee from this morning that i never got to finish <laughs> so i have to wash that um i kind of just took my keurig back here because it's an appliance that i'm going to be using literally daily and my k-cups my k-cup stand is over there but i'm just going to move it behind the keurig because that is the most convenient So yeah, this is my coffee cup now. I threw out my old coffee cup, but yeah. So this is what it's looking like. Um, I don't really have much going on in here. I have my Totoro gang right here. Um, just some random stuff, my name tag and stuff because I'm going to work tomorrow. Um, I have my little pantry going on in here. I use like a shelf stacker. So it's kind of like a little mini pantry going on in there. Up in this drawer, I have some more. I have like all my extra K cups, my salt and pepper, sugar, my bustelo, peanut butter, nut butter, stuff like that. Um, I mean, that's actually cookie butter, but anyway. And then I have some silverware and appliance, not appliances, silverware and paper plates and stuff. And then in this drawer, I literally just have random things in here my extension cord, because I don't know what I need that for yet. Okay, over here, I have. The recliner, I got that cat paw plushie at the American Dream Mall right before I left New York and I'm in love with it. And then this is my bed with all of my squishmallows. My boyfriend got me this alpaca blanket um, for Christmas last year, I love it. So I kind of just have it there. Over here is my nightstand, don't mind the mess. I have some receipts and a sticker. Actually, maybe you guys would be interested in the sticker. I got this sticker, it's Gojo. And I'm going to put them on my car. And then I got this car freshener. And I forgot to put these in my car when I was decorating my car. So, But yeah, so I just have a picture of my boyfriend and I. I got this little lamp at Walmart because, like I mentioned earlier, like there was no light other than this one here. So um, I got this little lamp. All the receipts that I need to scan for fetch my trash can um i didn't really know where to put this vacuum so i just tucked it in this corner for now i don't really have much going on in here i have my wax melts my portable charger and my vix and my tiger bomb and then there's nothing under there but that's probably where i'm going to store my slippers which i got these slippers from target so so cute and fluffy uh don't mind the pickles i'm sorry i moved my fridge and i forgot to pick my cheerios back up but i put my pickles out there because I want, I'm about to eat some, so just ignore that. Anyway, um, my fridge, literally nothing in the freezer except for ice cubes. 
And then in here, I have some mandarin oranges, ranch, cream cheese, guacamole, water, and my Brita, um, cran apple juice, because it's literally one of my favorite juices. I already washed and con um, put my carrots, grapes, and red bell peppers in these containers, my strawberries, eggs. Um, this is what I prepped for lunch tomorrow, if you guys are interested. So this is lunch tomorrow. I have some bell red bell peppers to eat with this guacamole, um, some grapes, some carrots with ranch, and then underneath I just have um, some Caesar salad and peanuts. So that is going to be what I'm packing in my lunch box tomorrow. Um, here I just have two creamers. I usually get the really giant um, cold stone creamer, but they didn't have the big size and I know I'll go through that pretty quick. So I grabbed this Cinnabon one as well, almond milk. And then here I just have another salad kit, a red bell pepper and some cubed uh, Kobe fat cheese, which is my favorite kind of cheese. That brings us over here. I literally just have a bunch of munchies in this basket. That is, I literally have nothing in these drawers. <laughs> um, I'm sure I'll end up eventually using them, but for now, there's nothing in them. So I figured I could kind of temporarily use this as a prepping place if I needed to. For instance, um, I can bring my Keurig right here and plug it into the wall right there. Um, there's an outlet behind the fridge and I can just use my Keurig on here instead of trying to, you know, I explained earlier because I'm lazy, but anyway. Um, oh yeah, I forgot my desk. This is my desk. I kind of just threw my pink blanket on here. My Totoro book bag that I got at Comic-Con. A little different, but I got these flowers from my boyfriend as one of my graduation gifts. Um, I put the trash can that they gave me over here. I completely missed that trash can. Anyway, I prepped my backpack for tomorrow for work. So I just have that sitting here. Uh, my wax melter, my um, sponsor gave me this smell good. Um, all of my manga. So as you can see, well, maybe you can't see, but I'll show you on the other side since it came out. But um, I actually ended up getting command hooks so that I can tuck these curtains back. And this is what they look like. They're just really big command hooks. So yeah, I just got that so that I can tuck my curtains back a little bit. And this is what it looks like. So yeah, I'll give you guys an overview real quick. to just eat some pickles and relax because I'm exhausted my back is killing me and I deserve it so I hope you guys like this video I know it turned out to be really long but I mean I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you're interested in seeing more military lifestyle and vlogging also budgeting videos which I am gonna try to start budgeting on the first of next month because your girl needs to get back on budget <laughs> but anyway if you're interested in these kind of videos make sure that you hit the subscribe button and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and i will see you in my next one thank you so much